god, this is the most amazing moment of my entire life. We are just here in this national park. We are the only Jeep here and we are surrounded by hundreds of Asian elephants. Jeep Safari in the Koldala National Park. Now there are lots of national parks here in Sri Lanka, but the reason that we chose this particular national park is for one very special reason. This is the Elephant Gathering. It's the largest gathering of Asian elephants anywhere in the world and only happens during the dry season in the Kaudula and Manira National Parks. The Elephant Gathering doesn't necessarily happen every year in the Koldala National Park or the Manira National Park. It kind of happens in both. The two parks, although two separate parks, are actually divided by what is known as an elephant corridor, which is kind of a funny name, but all it is is it's just thick, dense jungle, and it's what the elephants use to cross between the two parks, because obviously they're wild elephants, so they are free to roam wherever they like. Check with your local guide to find out where the elephants are, because you don't really want to miss out because you went to the wrong park. That would be really sad. Oh my gosh, you guys. We've just seen our first elephant. I love these open top Jeeps. This is gonna be so good. We were just speaking to our guide and he says that if you come in the morning, there's almost no one here. We're the only Jeep here, we're gonna have the whole place to ourselves. Whereas if you come in the afternoon, he said there's like 150, 200 Jeeps here and the place is packed. So I think we made a really good decision. We did our first Jeep Safari earlier this year in Nepal and that was amazing but there was no elephant so I have a feeling oh today's just gonna be like the best day ever. Let's look up. Yes. <laughs> we've been in the park for five minutes and we've already seen our first animal. It was just a deer, but like also it was just a deer. It was two deers. It was two deers. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, 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 there's so many elephants. <laughs> this is the most amazing moment of my entire life. We are just here. In this national park, we are the only Jeep here and we are surrounded by hundreds of Asian elephants. Oh my God, this is just so magical. Oh my God, the baby ones are so cute. I don't know who said you should come and do this safari in the afternoon, but, and I can't believe we're about to ruin this for everyone, but this is the morning, you know, it's 6.30, and this is it. This just us, literally just us and hundreds of elephants. Look, guys, there is no other Jeeps here, no one. Not a single Jeep. It's just us and the elephants. They're so close, you know. Our driver says they're quite dangerous, so it's not wise to get out and be near them and, you know, they'll probably kill you. But this is a good distance and they're really quite close. You know, that's like 20, 30 meters, like not far for such a lot of elephants. And what I actually really like about this is You've got this giant herd of elephants here and there's a few others scattered around, but you can see the tree line. And if you're watching really carefully, you can see the elephants coming out of the elephant corridor and into the park where 
the elephants just pass between the two parks through the jungle. And so if you look really carefully, you can see the elephants slowly coming out as they come out to feed in the morning. I've never seen anything like it. This is what travel's about. This is why you do it. It's so good. Elephants, 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 and more elephants. Oh my god. Oh my heart. Oh my god. Fun fact about elephants. Baby elephants don't actually have control over their trunk until they're like two years old. So for the first two years of their life, they just have this thing that's like coming out their face. It's just like God, you wouldn't want to make it angry. Over here you can see one of the elephants actually has tusks which is really quite rare for Asian elephants. So African elephants, it's pretty common for them to have tusks, but with Asian elephants, only like maybe two, three, or four of the male elephants will grow the tusks. So it's really rare to see the elephants with the tusks. So we are so lucky. We are literally like 20 meters away from one of the elephants with tusks. This is just unreal. Actually really quite lucky. This is our second male elephant with tusks today. So pretty chuffed about that but you can notice that with his front foot, he's actually kicking up the grass and then grabbing it with his trunk because the grass is quite short and dry. Rather than trying to grab the grass with his trunk, he's like kicking it up into a pile and then picking up the pile. It's so cool. I'd never actually seen that before. How amazing were those elephants? Wow, 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 wow. We have jumped back in the Jeep. Actually, we never got out of the Jeep, but we have driven a little bit further to see what else we can find in the park. And we just spotted some water buffalo over in the distance. This area that we're driving in, in the wet season, it actually becomes a lake. This whole entire area, like 250 hectares becomes a lake which is just crazy. It's crazy to think that right now it's a road and it's totally dry. There is no water here except for like the small amount over in the distance. So it's crazy to think that once the rain comes, once the monsoon season hits, that this fills up and becomes a lake. Guys, there's one lone elephant in the distance. This has just been one of the most magical mornings. Like to be this close to such magical creatures is just, it's hard to explain the feeling. When we did our safari in India, we saw a tiger and that was amazing, but we were one of like, I would say 50 Jeeps. Last night we had a bit of a like, oh no, we've booked for the morning. Should we change and go in the afternoon? And I'm so glad we didn't change because this, this might be my favorite travel experience of all time. It's the time where it's starting to heat up. So it is starting to get a little bit warmer. I'm feeling a bit warmer. And I can imagine that these elephants are certainly feeling a bit warmer. If you look really carefully, you can see them starting to head back into the forest. The herd is like starting to pack up, just go chill out in the shade during the day. And then that's it until this afternoon when it cools down and they come back out again. We've just been so lucky. And once again, sorry to make you all jealous, but <laughs> we are, the only people here for this moment. Oh, so good. I think that's what's making this even more special is the fact that it's just us. Like we are the <laughs> only Jeep here. It's just us and all these elephants. Like this, so special. Honestly, like this is just so magical. It's so hard to put into words like how I'm feeling right now because it's just like, this is, I'm just so happy. Like my heart is just so content and so happy.